Hello and welcome to Vampire. We are just about to head toward Whitechapel. Uh, can we just drop down? Yeah, we can. <clears throat> and uh, we're level 9 now, so I did distribute some uh, points. And maybe... We have a better heal, that's basically it. A uh, few new abilities that I have yet to try out. So this place is in, uh, <coughs> in a pretty bad spot. Serious? I can jump up. Okay, let's just jump up. No, you bastard. Oh, level 18. Oh, this is a uh, dangerous one. Time for a snack. Concerning the recruitment of new boys in Whitechapel, I think I've found one. I'll be. He's as stupid as a stool, uh, but though... But tough, I mean. <clears throat> uh, I asked him to prove me he could get some drugs from the black market and deliver it quickly and nicely. Next time we meet, I'll tell him he he's accepted as a, a vet boot boy and he must now meet the bosses to get his orders. I see. This might not be the place we should be heading towards. Are these the vet boys? Why are they called vet boys? <laughs> hmm. Can we go inside here? Custom marker. Yeah, can we just replace, uh, erase those? Okay. That's where the main quest is, apparently. <clears throat> and that's the only quest we got. Anyway, we're gonna check out the building. Hopefully these guys are not gonna piss themselves at the sight of me. Because... Then I have to eat them. Uh, with their piss pants. Pens... Building. Keep out. I could eat the rat, but I don't want to. Apparently, Katagan is talking, but I can't hear him. I want to see the <gasps> subtitles. <laughs> Ah! 
You bastard. Wow. This is uh, definitely a more serious uh, problem than the city knows. I see vampires everywhere. First, I felt bad about being a vampire. But, at this point, I just need to be a vampire, just to have a chance, I guess. Get away from me! Don't touch me with your disgusting No! Hmm. Hey there, mister. You wanna talk? What happened? Who are you? It's all right, sir. You're safe now. Oh, a fellow Englishman. Thank you, sir. For a moment, I thought those bloody heathens had kill me. What are you doing here? This place is not safe. Yeah, it's a cesspool, but it's mine. I came to collect some overdue rent, but those who still live here have gone completely bonkers. <coughs> You're very lucky to be alive. Yeah, filthy immigrants. Fucking savages, every one of them. And now with this bloody fever, they're just animals. You can find safety of sorts in Whitechapel. If you're quick and cautious, you'll be able to avoid the... savages. Well, we can't kill him. But do we want to? I think we want to. They didn't even give me a reward. What a bastard. Was I that evil to deserve such punishment? My only regret is that no one will mourn me. For I have never been loved. The district will suffer the consequences of your actions. But what I want to see is that... Could it be a positive consequence? This is Braille. I need someone who can read this. Well, I can't. Time to bail. What is this? A rat? No, we're gonna leave the rat. All yours, rat. Uh, it seems like uh, we can only have four abilities and an ultimate ability equipped at, at one time. So, despite the fact that the game offers you a lot of abilities, we need to be uh, peculiar about uh, which ones we're gonna use. So I need to go to Whitechapel. Hey, misters, what's up? A leech! A leech! This one's mine! You'll pay for this! No. Oh, that was a good dodge. Mine. I need more stamina. Yeah. 
I was basically stunned for two seconds. Christ, he's dead. I don't know. Aren't I the murderer now? Shotgun shell, but I don't really have guns. I only have one pistol. Maybe we need to buy some guns. Large box of pills. in peace. Report about Pembroke. Vampire activity. <clears throat> Sir, having observed the Pembroke hospital for two weeks now, and we can confirm vampire activity there, first we now have proof of the presence of a female leech inside the hospital. Please this clever. She acts like a mental patient to hide her true unholy condition. I personally sneaked inside the hospital and heard the creature whining about her need for blood since her body is decaying. Okay, <clears throat> but it gets worse. The administrator of the Pembroke Hospital is Dr. Swansea. According to our team leader, Amanda Tiltum, who died yesterday in a fight against the Skull by the canal, he may be a member of the Brotherhood of St. Paul. <clears throat> If that's true, then there may be something big going on at Pembroke. Maybe even a nest of vampires protected by those bloody traitors of the stole. We don't know what to do, but we are convinced you better come quickly with reinforcements and heavy gear. I see. Is that a good weapon? Previous Steak. 15 stun, but 35 stamina to do it? That's quite a lot. Maybe I should uh, <clears throat> level up some of my weapons. Weapon ability parry. I only have one revolver, so I'm only fighting bullets now, but it doesn't really matter. Even the revolver I have is, is meh by the looks of it. This place is so damn dark. So where am I supposed to go? Can I... Is this just a dead end? The entire thing? Seems like we have one way to go, but we will need to go back. Can we just go this way? Oh, a safe. New collectible. Come on. <laughs> so, it seems like uh, the way to go is back. We could have also like, skipped this entire place. Maybe I'm wrong. But I suppose it's worth checking out. <clears throat> So we go outside, and this is where we know, need to go toward the hospital. Oh 
Oh no. I need to heal. Rest in peace, mister. What kind of pistol is that? I really like this, uh, uh, weapon. Stuns and deals a lot of damage. Perfect. I didn't want to do that. I wanted to loot the... the bin. I understand the, the concern about the vampire crisis. Come on, trying to kill me? How do they even know that I'm a vampire? more stamina if there was a way to restore my stamina that's what I need <laughs> Roger the wall Seems like if I <clears throat> attack with less stamina, then I just do less damage. Rest in peace, wall. Do you have some good weapon? One shilling? Wow, that's really disappointing. I guess he was called the wall for no reason. Even cadets can jump up, but should I? What's over here? Nothing. It's locked, all right. There's, this has got to be an exit that I can't go towards yet. Okay, we gotta check the map. <clears throat> so I got pretty close to Whitechapel. Uh, I just need to go back and take a ride. What the hell is this? <laughs> Oh, I need 
heals. They're hungry. Come, on, come over here. You snack. Oh, come on. I'm, I was dealing with your valve wolf problem. Come over here, mister. I'm doing the heals. What? I'm getting shot at? No, you bastard. Alright, snack time. Damn. My true calling is definitely killing people. Where the hell am I? I just wanted to go to Whitechapel. It is proving to be more difficult than I thought. It looks like a pub. Can we go in? This this gotta be it, right? I cannot enter. Not from this side. Okay. Am I the wrong way again? Oh, we can go here. Perfect. <clears throat> Whitechapel. This neighborhood is linked somehow to the kind Lady Ashbury's blackmail. New hideout is available in the district. Right there. Can we travel between hideouts? That's apparently an option in some games. Fred. But it doesn't seem like it's this is one of those games. Let's find this Petrescu fellow. Can I find my uh hideout? Large box of pills. Whatever that is worth. Guys, what did you do? Me, I'm not dying of some piss stinking alley reeking worse than a weak old lavy. Am I supposed to have a talk with them? They seem to be fine, or is this guy critically wounded? Doesn't seem like it. Are you alright? The bastard hit the wall next to me. I don't even know if he meant to miss. If you've been hurt, I can help you. I'm a doctor. Name's Albert. Remember it. Now bugger off. The man you were looking for is dead. I found the recruiter you were expecting. He's dead, but he carried a note. The wet boot boys have accepted your application. I knew it! I told you I was tough enough. I'll be free soon. You're so gullible. You're being manipulated by these criminals. What's worse is that you're clever enough to know better. You're all fancy words, none of which concern me. Go worry about someone else. I'm fine and I have a future here. I'm looking for Dorothy. Do you know Nurse Dorothy Crane from the Pembroke Hospital? If you know anything about her, I'd appreciate it. Never heard of her. She's pretty, I'll keep an eye out. Oh, come on. Did you steal that man's medication? What happened? Did you really steal that man's medication? Hey! 
I didn't do anything. It ain't me. Maybe he confused you with someone else. Picked an easy target, didn't you? Medication and drugs are a rare commodity in East London. So you picked an easy target, didn't you? Sod off, mister. You ain't got no clue what's going on here. Bastard was a soldier in the war, so now he's got the right to shoot me. It's true. I'm not familiar with this part of town. Perhaps you could help me. I said sod off. Go find yourself another guide. Hmm. Goodbye, young man. The wet boots will be proud okay. of me. Okay. <clears throat> it's all a bloody joke to you. You can actually. Oh. How are you, boy? I'm not your. Mesmerize him. No Goodbye, worry. young man. The wet boots will be proud of me. Black, bloody heart, boy. What? What's going on here? That was weird. I couldn't go in one direction. What? Shooting a boy in the middle of a street. Not the best thing to do, wouldn't you say? What? You saw what happened? Who are you? I'm Dr. Reed. And I'd like to ask you a few questions, if you promise me to set your gun aside. No. Look, I I'm not a violent man. I'm Benjamin Palmer, doctor. And no one can help me. Not even you. I'm looking for Dorothy. Do you know Nurse Dorothy Crane from the Pembroke Hospital? Have you heard anything? It's funny, I've been searching for her too. I need some pills. But the woman is a phantom, if you ask me. Really? And why is that? Word is she ain't real. She's a cover for some doctor who runs an illegal dispensary for migrants. What are your troubles? Perhaps you could focus for a moment and tell me your troubles. I'm sick, broke, and my son just stole my pills. Everything's coming up roses. What can you tell me about this place? Nothing to say, really. This is where I used to live, and this is where I live now. What can you tell me? Nothing to say. You have no family? You don't have anywhere to go. No family that would welcome you. Not since the death of my wife, Albert's mother. She was sick, you see. Long before the flu and all this shit. You mean you used to have a better life? Yeah, I had a wife, a home, and a job. I even used to have a name. And now I'm just Ben. Ben the Tramp. Why didn't you sh shot this boy? Whatever the boy did, I'm sure he didn't deserve a public execution. I swear I didn't want to hit him. It's just that I'm sick in the head, you see, and the boy just he just fake me last nerve. What is it, Benjamin? It was the war, wasn't it? Your nerves are shot, aren't they? I need some answers, Private. From one soldier to another. The doctors called me a liar, a coward. Put me in a straight jacket, locked me up. Finally, they sent me back to the front lines with a handful of tablets. It's a pity that doctors still practice such barbaric methods. It's a dishonor to our profession. Now only the pills stop me thinking about this shit. To not hear the explosions. I'm even scared of the dark these days. Okay. A gun, alcohol, and a bad temper make a terrible cocktail, sir. Goodbye for now. So he needs medication. Well, he's very much enjoys it. How are you, boy? I'm not your boy, all right? Now piss off. We don't have enough clues. 
Goodbye, young man. The wet boots will be proud of me. Hmm. So we can check out the blackmail. Also, I wouldn't mind checking out the hideout. Who are you? Good evening, Benjamin. Can I help you? I'm afraid not, Mr. Reed. Benjamin Palmer? Why A did gun? You... I'll... He moves so, so much. Problems. As long as you have the money. Good evening, miss. Good evening, sir. Are you interested in a miraculous cure for this unknown and deadly epidemic? Actually, I am. Then you have come to the right place. The famous Swanborough Cordial is all you need to help keep you in perfect health. Oh, really? Why didn't I hear about it during my studies? I'm Jonathan Reed, by the way. Dr. Jonathan Reed. Ah, my brother has spoken of your research, sir. I'm Loretta Swanborough, and it's always a pleasure to meet a fellow healer. What? Do you know Nurse Dorothy Crane from the... You're buying her story? I'd like to know more about her. I don't like to talk about competition. Competition, you say? Never met her, but it seems she provides some sort of medical care to the poor. The whole thing has to be some sort of scam, if you ask me. Unbelievable. I'd like to see what kind of medicine you're selling. This means nothing to me. Good evening. Tell me, who intrigues you most in Whitechapel? The region itself is something to see, but I would say Camellia the mute florist who gives away her flowers. Is there anyone else should I, I should avoid? Is there anyone I should avoid? Cadogan Bates, without a doubt. The bloody bastard remorselessly exploits poor migrants as soon as they get here. Cadogan? Well, he's dead. What do you think of the locals? What do you think of the locals? Most of them are afraid or desperate. They all come to me eventually for my remedy. I see. That's all we got. Goodbye, Miss Swanborough. Perhaps we'll talk again. In this game, it's not easy to investigate. To all your problems. So, where is this uh, hideout? We know of a merchant. Apparently, the hideout is somewhere around here. Dead inside? <clears throat> I can upgrade my weapons. I have one weapon that I actually like. My club. Can we upgrade that? Can we upgrade the uh, something over here? Is this the hideout? I don't know. I'm seeing some stuff on the ground. Dead inside again. Okay, a lot of loot. Not sure how much it's worth, actually. Oh, this is the crafting bench. Guns. Two-handed. Can only go to level five. <clears throat> I like the Cut goal. What is this? Increase damage dealt by 10%. Add free stun points when the weapon hits. Uh, is that an upgrade I can give it? 
decrease the stamina consumption by 10. That's pretty good. Or... I had 3 stun points. I don't know how valuable are the stun points. Oh, okay. Do I wanna commit to this cut goal in the first place? I like it. Perfect. Legendary. It's a good good weapon, I like it. What about the uh, common machete? Oh, it actually can't even go to a high level. Used. Okay. Maybe bone handed is just not as good. <clears throat> Even the upgrade is not that good. What? That mace looks good. So. We can go outside. Oh, we can uh, just spend our XP. Not sure on what though. We can spend it on not that actually. We can get more healing. We don't really use that. Let's bring more abilities. That's 600 points for 50 health. Can have more blood. I heal more when I bite. Hard biting. Yeah, let's do that. Even even harder biting. <clears throat> or just go for a little bit more heal, a little bit more blood capacity. Maybe I should have went for the heal instead. Okay, he's level 10 now, and we can actually get an ultimate ability. These seem to cost 1000. We can only use one. Cost zero. Recovery 10 minutes. Cost zero. Recovery 100 seconds. And cost zero, same thing. Not sure which one is the. Ideal one. Oh, never mind that. Actually, <clears throat> they all cost nothing and uh, have 99 seconds recovery time. Three hundred AOE damage. Not sure about that. I don't know about the rage. Anyway, uh, no, 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 no. We want to confirm it. Oh, one guy's dead. Was that a bad guy? Because this is the health status of the area. Alfie. It's it's red. It's red because I killed him? Or it's red because he was a bad guy? I don't know. I'm not sure how this works. Is the point that, that you should not kill guys? Or that you should kill the right guys? That's 
Jak ten. Yeah. Locking the camera is acceptable. No, it's it's good op optional, I suppose sometimes, but it's not great. Can we just go outside? Different kind of Syrians. I don't really use that either. I do have two serums equipped uh, that uh, give us heal. No, we got back to this place. Oh, that's not what I wanted. We need to go back and come out some, well, around the part we entered. Like that would be acceptable. But I do find it somewhat, somewhat confusing. Keep out again. Does that work? It's not exactly the the same door, but anything that puts us uh, toward the hospital is good enough. Below critical. Okay. I just jump. I don't want to eat you, rat. So, time to go to the chapel. Apparently, it's very close by. What? Well, what is this? Find and talk to Darius Petrescu. This is the guy we were coming to to talk to. How big is this game? Well, no, I didn't want to open the guy. All right, let's just go inside. Oi! What do you want? Leave me alone. Good evening, sir. I'm Dr. Reed. I'm looking for nurse Dorothy Crane. There is no Dorothy Crane here. Now goodbye. I'm afraid this medical leaflet says the opposite, sir. Really? Well, I'm afraid I'm going to close this door right now. Go bother someone else, Mr. Doctor. <laughs> Mr. Doctor. To enter I don't that think house, so. I must discover who this man really is. Maybe I could start by observing what he's up to. Oi. There's no one in. What do you mean there's no one in? There's nobody here. I got the perfect in. Just stare inside his his apartment. Until he gets so fucking pissed off that he just comes outside. Person I'm looking Strange for. man was at the door with the pass for our medical facility. I refused him entry. Darius, how could you know he didn't need our help? His clothes were too finely tailored to be for Whitechapel. Perhaps just the friend of that stray poet who is always about. Richard Nidacott? No, not of the same cloth, this man. I suspect some machination from that journalist. Clayton Darby? Is he still asking questions? Yes. I saw him drifting around St. Mary's Church. I swear he is tracking me just downwind. I'm on to you. Time I must to go talk get to that journalist or the poet. They must know about Darius. Nearby the church they just mentioned. 
Where the hell is that? Oh, I see. Anyway, guys, uh, that's it for now. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.